Uh, my name's Cameron Lee and I'm a science fiction memorabilia collector. I fell in love with Star Trek from the first episode I ever watched. I've always absolutely loved it. Um, and I started off with the Star Trek Fat File Collection, which was basically a, a collection of everything to do with the films, the characters, the episodes. Um, 690 issues, I believe it was, in total. All separately folded, absolutely beautifully done. It's a long time collecting this. You've got the original communicator, that's flick up. You've also got the first of the Star Trek phases, which is absolutely brilliant. That's the original tricorder which Spock or the Bones used to use because it could be a medical or a science tricorder. That's from Star Trek and it is a proper pocket watch and it works. At the front here you've got every member of the cast of the original series Star Trek. Now I do make models and this is of the bridge of the Enterprise 1701. Uh, you can look at two to three months to build one model. You've got to get the painting absolutely spot on. The old Klingon bird of prey. Absolutely aw awesome ship. Love that. It's not about phases on strong. It's not about la you know uh, launch the photon torpedoes. It's not about beaming out. It's about an ideology of life. Two techies know that, and that's why it's become something that nobody, no other television series has ever done. First ever screen kiss ever done with a black and white person. That, that was with um, Lieutenant Nahora and Captain Kirk. Never ever done before. You had a Russian. You, you know, you had uh, an Asian. Asian actors were all stereotyped to do one thing only, to be an Asian. Because the bridge was interracial, they brought the blacks and the Asian community into the mainstream of filmmaking, not paying stereotypical parts anymore. There's Lieutenant Ahura there. She met the legendary Martin Luther King. At a time that she was about to say to Jean Roddenberry, I'm leaving. And Martin Luther King said, you can't leave Star Trek. Do you not realise that you are putting black people on the map. You single-handedly are doing that without even realising that you're doing it. And when she realised, hang on, he's right, she didn't have to notice it. Thank God, because it would have been horrible to lose, some, you know, lose somebody of, of her quality. That's my prized possession. It's the Q plate. It is nowadays never available. The last one I saw of these went two years ago on eBay for £750 for that plate and uh, nowadays I reckon you can put at least another £250 on that, if not a lot more, because they're just not available. It's just not available at all. There you've got the Romulan, uh, Romulan Warbird which is an absolutely brilliant ship and beneath it from um, you've got a Klingon Raider, you've got a, a Kazon Raider Many, 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 many hours of painting took that to do that. That was horrendous. Uh, you've also got another Klingon ship there, which is their main heavy battle cruiser. Every time I leave my loft, I got stuck into this little bit of a habit. And I always, on leaving the loft, go... Which anybody who's a Trekkie, no, that sound. <laughs>